Well, happy anniversary to us, meaning you the viewers, and me here at Gideon's Tactical, all of us together are what make this channel run. And we are celebrating this week, six years on YouTube. And in this video, we're gonna talk giveaway, a Sabra Solo 21, plus a bunch of extras, mid-year gear sale that I have a bunch of uh, my used gear going up, channel and family updates, and plans for the future. So stay tuned, let's have some fun. Well, as I've said, guys, Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys have made this channel be able to be possible and be able to be up here on YouTube for six years. It's crazy. When I look back at the old videos compared to what we're producing now, content, ideas, it's just awesome and amazing. And, and you guys really pushed me to get to the place that we are today. And if, and if you guys weren't watching, Little GT Junior is going to be running around. I'm sure we're going to get some of uh, him in the background. Um, but... Uh, <clears throat> that you guys have really made it possible to have this channel and have it last this long. I can throw up videos forever, but if no one watches, there's really no point and I'm just making them for myself. It's awesome that I have the ability to present a, a video, you know, uh, in my area, kind of a work of art, you know, I'm putting my, my, my experiences, my thought processes, my ideas into a video, putting it up and then you guys enjoy it and get something out of it as well. So it's just an awesome experience all the way around. And I want to thank you guys for your support and being part of the GT family. You know, I call it the GT family for a reason. I feel like we're part of a family here, particularly you regular subscribers, you guys who come in week after week, watching, commenting. I love to see the, the, <laughs> Uh, now I know some of you well enough that I know when I post a video, I, I'm like, well, that, that person's going to make this comment. This person's going to think this way probably. And I'm usually right. And it's just cool to see that, that idea, that, that push, that conversation and be uh, a family here in that capacity. Even though we're, we may be a digital family, I do feel like we are uh, a family. Sometimes we agree, sometimes we disagree, but it's just a blast to do it all together. So family update and, and some update stuff just with the channel. Um, you can hear GT Jr. running around. Uh, about three weeks ago, Mrs. Gideon's Tactical and I added another member to the family, and now we have GT Jr. Mark II. Uh, he is awesome. He is doing great. Uh, his big brother is acclimating well to him. They're really doing well together. Uh, my wife, G Mrs. Gideon's Tactical, is doing great. No issues. And, uh, you know, we're, ju we're just acclimating to having two kids in the family now, having an infant again, and just what that all feels like, what that all looks like. Tommy's doing great. He's a champ. Tommy the trail dog for all the different stuff going on in the family with transition like that. And I just can't wait to get these guys regularly out in the outdoors. We've done some little, you know, here and there excursions and little day hikes and, and different things like that, but I really can't wait to do overnight camping. Uh, little GT Junior and I are gonna do a practice run in the yard. You know, he's like just over two years old. So we're gonna do a practice night out in the backyard here in the next couple of weeks um, before we actually go out, you know, and, and get him acclimated to sleeping in a sleeping bag instead of his crib and all that type of stuff. So it's gonna be, it's gonna be a blast. I might film that. That might be a fun little uh, different type of video that we're gonna be doing. But with uh, two kids now, a lot is changing in life. The channel, I'm planning on not changing anything. You may see a lot of like backyard videos for the next couple weeks just because I'm here at home. I got some time off of work and uh, working with them. So a lot of EDC and flashlight and pocket knife stuff. But we're going to get back in the outdoors, get back into packs and, you know, uh, um, larger, you know, fixed blades and survival knives and hatchets and all that stuff. Got a lot of plans for the fall and into the, the winter. But um, just be patient and maybe if, you know, there's a couple more days going by before the next next video goes up than usual that's why just trying to balance infant and you know toddler and wife and work because this is not my full-time gig guys you know um I, I share this sometimes here at the channel this is just a part-time thing i do i have a full-time 40 60 hour a week job i am a dad i'm a husband and I run this channel and I invest about 20 to 30 hours a week into this YouTube channel. And so uh, I just want to say thank you guys for your support with the hyperlinks and just kind of lay this out for you real quick so you understand the process. Uh, you know, the ads that you see on YouTube, that's about five, a fifth, sorry, that's about a fifth of the full 
pie of payouts that myself and most YouTubers get. The rest of the income comes through Blade HQ and Amazon and any other hyperlinks that we offer to you guys. So when you see something, regardless of the product that we're, that we're talking about that day or any other product, if you hit that link, that's the major majority of the income that comes into the channel and then I can invest it back in the channel. And uh, with now two children, there's some work that's changing with my wife. We're going to be looking at even more so just, you know, making sure that all of our time is spent really well, not only with family, but also with, uh, uh, you know, making ends meet, paying the bills. So I invest a ton back into the channel, but some of this also does help to pay bills. And as long as it continues to do what it's doing, I won't have to take time away from the channel to go, you know, deliver pizzas or, uh, you know, work a, a, a night shift, you know, stocking shelves. And some of you may do that and rock on to you guys. You guys may do that and you're, you know, you're working two, three jobs to make ends meet. And I'm so proud of you. You are awesome. You, you are amazing for your willingness to do that. And I'm ready to do that any moment if need be. But uh, if I have to, that's going to take time away from the content that we're doing here. So it, I just want to let you guys know that when you do watch, when you do click a Blade HQ link or an Amazon link, that is literally not only putting money back in the channel, because we buy, you know, like 70% of the gear that we test out and review here, but also um, is helping me to continue to say, you know what, it makes more sense for me to go produce a video, then it makes sense financially for me to go, you know, deliver pizzas for four hours or six hours or work, you know, a barista somewhere on the side or something like that. I don't have to do that because you guys continue to support the channel with your viewership and link purchases. So just thank you. Thank you for that. You are literally putting fuel in the gas tank and getting his tactical so we don't break down and we can continue to go and do what we do and invest the time and effort and purchase the gear to be able to make the content that we do here for you guys. So thank you, thank you, thank you for just continuing to use those hyperlinks in the description below for any gear that you may see or any purchases that you're thinking about doing regardless if it's in the video or not. And so I alluded to it a little earlier, I am doing a mid-year uh, gear sale over on eBay. I will have some links over on my Facebook page and I'll, I'll see if I can annotate it in to get to like the homepage of my eBay account as well. So you guys can go check them out. About about 20 different items, some pocket knives, some fixed blades, um, some discontinued stuff that isn't for sale anymore. Got some day packs, got some multi-tools, flashlights, and it's all stuff that we previously reviewed. Some stuff that I totally love, but either I have multiples of or I just don't need them. You know, I don't need 50 day packs anymore. I mean, I, I just don't have room for it. I don't have a need for it. And I have gear that ha needs a really good home. And so there's some really good prices up there. And then when you guys purchase them, you're going to get a good deal. And then I'm going to be able to invest the income back into the channel for more equipment, more gear to test out and review. So we are doing that mid uh, year sale and that's going to be up for the next couple days over on eBay. And I'll try and have links not only here on YouTube, but also if, if you're having trouble finding it, go on over to Facebook and there will be links that will take you straight over to the eBay account. Uh, and then giveaway time. So I have the newest generation of Solo 21 Sauber Gear backpacks. Great day pack, super awesome. And uh, go check them out as well. They're a great company. Have seen them grow from being a small company to really, you know, hitting the stride and really good, doing well. You're getting Israeli made products. So it's not overseas, you know, Asian produced stuff. Uh, you're getting uh, some really good items from Sauber Gear. And I wanted to give this day pack away. It's brand new, never been used. Uh, this is just their second generation of the Solo 21. It's a phenomenal, uh, you know, day pack, 21 liters, has lots of Molly attachments all the way around, huge water bottle pouches. And I wanted to add a couple things in. So you're gonna be getting the coveted, Gideon's Tactical Patch. I need to do another batch of those soon. I'm trying, guys. So many so many irons in the fire right now. I'm gonna try and get another batch produced here, but you will get one of these attached to your pack. You're gonna get, be getting a brand new uh, 48 ounce silo Nalgene, which fits great in these giant pouches right here. So this is my favorite type of Nalgene. You'll be getting a secondary little pouch that is attached on the inside that you can, you know, ex to the out exterior if you want to. Brand new Stanley cook set with their two cups inside. This is a fantastic little setup. Great for day camping or, you know, hiking, that type of thing. Baco Laplander, brand new. And so I thought this would be fun. A brand new companion, not heavy duty companion, and a brand new, I can't remember, it's like an Armory X or something. I'll try and annotate it in, a Kydex sheath. So this is like a custom Kydex sheath. Great setup, clicks in real nice and snug. 
belt clip rotates 360 degrees really cool setup for a mora uh, companion so all those are going to be coming to one lucky winner um, that we i will share how you get entered into win at the end of the video so stay tuned um, for that one lucky person will be picked at random and i will ship this anywhere in the world this entire pack just basically giving you a really awesome setup for uh, a day pack set you know day hiking uh, kit to get you out there start enjoying the outdoors and that type of thing so um, one lucky winner anywhere in the world I will pick at random and I'll explain how you get entered in a win here in just a little bit and so before we wrap up and I explain how you get entered to win that possible day pack uh, just want to give you some updates for the channel itself some ideas that I'm thinking about you know we're gonna continue to do gear reviews and all that type of stuff but uh, there's some new things I want to try out here at the channel and one of them that you're gonna start seeing is more concept videos and I'm not talking about like, here's a concept video on how to build a survival kit or how to build a bug out bag. That's not what I'm doing. I, you will see those obviously because we do that in EDC kits and all that. But really like life concepts, you know, concepts for life that maybe have nothing to do with a piece of gear. Um, just one example of something that I'm thinking about and you're going to see a whole video on this uh, coming down the line soon is... Uh, the, the idea of the amount of garbage that we use when it comes to cups. Now, I am not an environmentalist by any means, uh, but I would say that I'm a conservationist. I want to conserve the, the environment that we have and do it in a smart way, not through government regulations or different things like that. The government forcing you you know, to, to follow a particular step, type of rules or whatever. But there are simple things that I think we as outdoorsmen um, just prepare mind type of people can make simple, very, very simple steps with things that I'm sure that we probably already have. And just kind of changing our mindset on how we can maybe use a little bit less junk in our lives. So that's like a concept video I'm gonna be doing soon that we'll be talking about in you know weeks to come. And just other ideas like that, life videos and stuff, I wanna employ more of that and get a little bit more personal with some of you guys sometimes, get more real and just talk about other things that have maybe nothing to do with gear. So you're gonna see some of those and I'd wanna hear your guys' thoughts when you see those. Hey, I like this idea, keep going. Or you're like, dude, this is total bogus, waste of time, get back to you know reviewing gear. I wanna hear that from you guys when we um, post up those videos and you'll see them. It'll be obvious when I make those type of videos. Next up is this mailbag idea. So this is what I wanna start doing and we can kick it off right here. I will be making a separate video to really launch this because some people may not watch this particular video but they will watch the other one um, is I wanna to start to answer maybe like two questions from you the viewers live on a review uh, at least you know half the videos I do like every other video I want to do the mailbag where after we review something or in the middle of a review of whatever you know some zero tolerance knife I'm doing we're gonna pause for a second I'm gonna answer two questions from two separate viewers so that you guys will get your name on screen you know I'll shout, get a shout out to you guys and answer your question so to get involved in that and is if you are interested in possibly getting your question answered live on the channel then when you make a comment in any video, if you want to an answer on the channel, just put hashtag mailbag and then ask your question. And then I'll be looking for those throughout the comments. And if there's something that really stands out to me, I, I may grab it and then we're going to do it. And we're going to talk about it and I'll answer your question live on the air. <clears throat> now I'm asking you to please don't ask silly questions that I've already made like 50 videos on, okay? If you're going to be like, hey, what's your favorite survival knife? We've already talked about that like 50 times. The SD6 is the one and done best survival knife to just pick up, go, throw it, $115, you're good to go. Um, you know, there are all tons of other little idiosyncrasies, other options. If you have $300, there are better knives out there. If you have 50 bucks, there are better knives out there. I'm not, I don't want to answer that type of question in a mailbag question, right? I mean, I'm, I've done t hundreds of videos on that. Or, you know, what's your favorite um, EDC pocket knife? You know, if you could only have one EDC pocket knife, what would it be? You know, I mean, I've done so many videos that answer those type of questions. I'm looking for questions that are going to be kind of out of the box, you know, like, hey, who's your favorite founding father? And why? That's a great question. Um, hey, what is your must have uh, pair of sunglasses? Like these knock around GI Joe limited edition ones, links below. Um, 
I get no kickbacks for that right now. Um, but that's a, th these are really cool, fun glasses and you guys asked me and I, I love wearing them and they're fun. Um, you know, so, so whatever, stuff like that. Um, hey, I started dating a girl. Uh, she's awesome. You know, she, we want to get outdoors and start hiking. I want to get a, a girl specific backpack for her. You haven't really done a lot of those. Is there one that you would recommend to kind of get the ball rolling? Great. That's a great question. I haven't done a lot of women specific stuff and I can point you in the right direction. You know, those type of things. Hey, what's your favorite Bible character aside from Gideon and why? You know, I mean, like stuff like that is the, the questions that I'm looking for. What's your favorite like dream car? Uh, you know, would you ever own a jet ski? Uh, you know, well, like whatever. What's a hobby that you wish you could do that you can't? I mean, wherever, whatever, you know, uh, those are the type of questions I'll be looking for in these mailbag questions. But if you want to get involved in that, just put hashtag mailbag, put the comment in and I may grab it at random and start doing that here on the channel. But I want to start incorporating mailbag questions on a regular basis in our reviews. And finally, some of you comment, you know, like I'm having a hard time following you. I don't see all the videos you post up. I tried to do two to four videos, two, two minimum, four videos maximum in a week. And so if you're having trouble, because YouTube sometimes messes with algorithms and different things like that, make sure if you're subscribed, you hit that bell icon. There's a, the subscribe button. Then there's the bell icon right next to that. That makes sure it's in your news feed. And ultimately, if you like the content here, just come back to the homepage week in, week out, and you're going to see new videos all the time and also I'm always looking for new opportunities and I have some that again it's just so many you know so so many fires going right now so many so many um, irons in the fire that it's hard to spend time on and focus on any one thing but uh, there are other projects that I'm working on other um, avenues to get this content out I know uh, Instagram just launched their video streaming service I think Facebook's working on a video streaming service um, I'm contemplating doing a website to uh, not only start doing, you know, have another place to post the videos, but po possibly start doing more like blog reviews as well, you know, where there might be a couple photos and some paragraphs on what I think about a particular product um, and, and that capacity. So I'm thinking about possibly launching a, a website. It probably won't be until the beginning of the year, but um, there's that. And then uh, I know I'm working on also, um, what is it, an Amazon store versus just the Amazon links to give you guys more content that you can click on and look at in more um, consolidated ways than just the stuff that we're looking at in a particular review that will obviously help, again, support the channel in that way. Um, and I don't know, just, just trying to think of other opportunities. I have yet to still think of doing a Patreon account. I may do that to start doing firearm stuff again. Uh, I've kind of taken a back seat to that as YouTube has totally swapped out and changed everything um, with their algorithms and stuff. So uh, I'm looking, I am actively looking and trying to figure out some websites and locations that I can do firearm based stuff without all of the BS that goes into trying to put a firearm review up on YouTube. It's just not worth, um, worth it to me because I want to be able to end this channel on my terms when the day comes for that. I don't have no plans to do that, uh, but I don't ever want this channel just taken away from me and from us. You know, we're just one day we wake up and it's gone. It's deleted. Good luck. See you. Have a great life. You know, I want to be able to, in a season of my life where I feel like either the content just isn't there and the viewership isn't there, or that my life just gets so full and different that it just doesn't make sense to, you know, produce the channel anymore, job, you know, differences, whatever things happen. Until that day, though, I want to be able to end the channel on my terms. So I'm just trying to be smart about the content and how we produce it here at the channel. And I am wanting to continue to do the firearms thing because not only pushes me and grows me and makes my skills go better but uh it gives you guys good content but i gotta find the right platform and environment to do that okay and so finally guys to wrap this all up how do you enter in to win this and i'll annotate in when this is going to launch it's basically when the video goes live and then uh, the day that i will pick at random from the comments below please one comment per person this the the person you have 24 hours to respond to my comment i'll say hey you're the winner please email me if you don't email me within 24 hours i'm gonna pick somebody else uh, but all you have to do is in the comments below tell me how you would use this Solo 21 if you want it. Would it be your go-to day pack? Would it be a bug out bag that goes in your car or get home bag? Um, would it be your EDC bag that you're gonna carry around town? Uh, or is there some other thing? You know, is it gonna be a dedicated, um, you know, rock climbing bag or a dedicated, you know, range bag? I wanna know what you would use this for and how you would deploy it if you want it. Uh, and then that, that gets you entered in the win. And then as I said, you know, annotating right now below on the day that it says, I will pick it, I will uh, pick the winner, email, uh, comment on your post, and you'll have 24 hours to respond to me and email me so I can get this shipped out to you. And thank you guys all, all of you. GT Junior, high five buddy. 
and I and the family, thank you guys for being part of our family and making six years possible. Let's try and do another six. Let's do another six, guys, uh, here at Gideon's Tactical and just grow this thing. Um, thank you. God bless you. Jesus loves you. You guys are amazing. I pray for you guys that you are all blessed, that you see his love, and that he takes care of you and just shows his great, awesome love for you. Um, and uh, you guys are a major blessing, major, major blessing. Don't think that you are not valued because you're not only valued by me, but by your Heavenly Father. So love you guys. Stay equipped. Stay prepared. See you out there.